Hello, I'm in Balmain and uh, I'm really happy with my show. It looks really good and I think that's the main thing about doing an exhibition is you're looking at it, as I've said before, you're looking at it for four days or well, I'm looking at it for four days straight and I'm thinking, oh, do I like it? Oh, shit, I should have done a mark there and that's not really quite finished and I should have done better. Sure, all of these, even a masterpiece like this, I could do better, but you know, when is enough enough? And I'm really happy. So I'll just give you a little tour. You haven't seen this one, I don't think. It sort of changed from the time that I I did it on. I put it up and it got so many likes. And by then I'd already altered it and then sent it to the framer. But anyway, I, I do think it looks quite fabulous. So that's that one. And that's framed up with the float. Now when you float it, this is what that's called. Okay, hang on, can I show you? It's cut or torn. I get art scene to do that for me because I crap at anything that's supposed to be done properly. And they float it and they put a bit of um, um, some spaces underneath it and they put it behind so that it sits on the um, backing board. And it's beautifully done, see? And so it's like a shadow box. It sits on, sits out a bit and then that's actually perspex, right? So it's not so heavy. It's still bloody heavy, and that's why the one fell off the wall. But don't we don't talking about that. Nothing happened. It was fine. So this is this one. Really happy, and I've called that lyrebirds dance because I'm sure someone in there will find a lyrebird. But I just think it's quite joyous. So I'm happy with that one. See how I'm matching all my paintings today? This one I'm happy with. This one was one. It was a bit bit basic and so I've gone in and I've made it more complex and by making it more complex I've added more elements and scratching back and pushing pushing it more and I'm happy with it now this one here oh yeah this is the one I've had so many people in about this one okay it's done can you see it I would have to go right back here it looks fabulous thanks to Jocelyn right and I've had people come in and say, oh, it was so funny watching that video and this, all of that. And so I'm really glad that's how it ended up. So I'll give you a bit of a, a look. Let's go like this. And I quite like this little gap in here. That's all it needs. And it just gives you the whole perspective then of how it looks. I don't know whether someone's going to have that particular size wall to fit it on i don't know you know because it's actually two what is it 2.5 meters right by 80 which is unusual it would look nice um maybe over a credenza or a sofa or something but it is limiting whereas when you go meter by meter it's actually probably more dramatic in a big space um this one here i'm happy with this one's based on my drawings. You know how I do the drawings? And this is using spatula and um, all the different oranges. A lot of energy in there. Um, and I'll just show you this one because I love it. Mind you, I don't know which is up and which is down, but that means it works well but either way. But um, this is basically the tumbling rocks and everything, and I'm really, really happy with that one. So I thought you might like to see that. You see that? And how fabulous does it look? Again, framed up. So this is after I asked you and you said, show them to your their best that they can be. And that's what that is. So they, don't, they never look as good as when they're framed up. And I can see this in someone's house and bring a lot of joy and I'm really, really, really happy with it. So isn't that good? Okay, and this one, started off quite simple but I've really put more elements and that's why if you have the time to put it away come back put it away come back and because you you lose energy and you think oh that's all right that's all right then you come back to it and you think oh gosh that that's a bit you know a bit rough or that's a bit basic and so you've got the time to put in all the little details and the scratching back and just making it more complex you know all these little bits here that weren't there but now they are look at this love 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 all 
all that and yeah i'm happy with this and this is a a very limited palette type thing but it's also very easy for people to live with right because that's what at the end of the day you like to sell your work this one sold to a really lovely lady took it out david so good of him took it out to her house and it looks perfect in her space so I'm really happy that that's found a home. So yeah, that's a little bit of my um, exhibition. I've got some, a couple more and this one. The one that Jocelyn bought was crappy here and didn't like this. I still like it. I still like it. I don't care what she says. Uh, she likes this bit, but I find this bit a bit boring. I don't know. Anyway, I like it. And it's a bit of a showcase. But what I'm going to do, what I do during my exhibition is I move it round. So this afternoon I'm going to move it round. So people have been walking past will see, oh, okay, what's else changed, you know? So uh, just move it round, just confuse people, change the window. I love doing all that. I'm a frustrated merchandiser and I just love changing around. So that's my little sneak peek. Hope you enjoyed it. If you haven't been able to come along, that's okay. Send, if you want to see some, me to send you some pics or whatever, but I'm going to be doing quite excited because what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to a friend's home in Araluan and they have got the most beautiful fairy dell Dewar River place and I'm going to do a video and we're going to do videos together on how to draw and paint down on the Dewar River. So that's coming up in a few weeks. So yeah, that's what I'm looking forward to. If you can't make it for drinks tomorrow, that's okay. But there are free, it's free brews, you know, Prosecco. And come along and say hello. If not, that's okay. Just say hi. Love you. Thank you very much for supporting me. I really appreciate you dropping in and all the lovely comments. Thank you.